Hey guys, welcome to another episode of Mealtime Disney. Today, I'm in New Orleans Square once again. Right over here, directly in front of me, is the French Market. We were there in a previous episode. You want to see that? Click the annotation just popped up there on the screen. Today, um, I'm actually going to be at a restaurant that's right next door to a very popular attraction. That's right, it's Pirates of the Caribbean. But uh, the restaurant we're going to be trying out today is Royal Street Fernanda. And they have creamy clam chowder there. That looks pretty good, so we're going to get it. So. Let's go. Woo, look at that. There it is. It's a creamy clam chowder right there. All right, so in case you can't really tell, there isn't much seating over here, so um, we're going to sit back at the French market because uh, it's it's pretty crowded over there. So one second. All right, so believe it or not, I'm back in my old spot right here when I was here for the French market. So we're back basically at the French market, but I was over at the other restaurant, so, because it was, like, not much seating over there, so, sorry, but we're sitting at the French market once again, but we got something else, it's the creamy clam chowder, I never had cram clam chowder before in my life, so, uh, gonna be uh, interesting to try it out. Alright, so, if you remember from my French market episode, I got a mint julep, uh, drink, well, guess what? I got it again to go along with the clam chowder. I mean, we're in New Orleans Square, right? Gotta get the drink too, right? <laughs> All right, so we got a two for one deal once again. So, let's eat. Okay, but I'm betting that this is gonna be extremely hot. Whoa, it's got like a layer to it, see that? Oh yeah, it's, it's pretty warm, so I better stir this around. Okay, that's more like it. So once again, it's in a sourdough bread bowl, and as you can see, they gave me the top half here. <laughs> I can't put it back in. Oops. Um, probably wasn't supposed to do that, but my bad. Oh, look what's pulling in the station. It's the E.P. Ripley. That is cool. Oh, can't see it. There it is. Okay. I'm betting this is still going to be hot, but i got to start eating it now before it gets too cold. Hey, perfect music for this part of the video. First bite! <laughs> Not bad. The trains make a lot of noise over there. Wow, that is really good. Mmm. I don't know if that was clam or potato that I just ate, but that was really good. Okay, here we go. I'm betting I'm gonna have the exact same reaction I had last time when I first tried this out. <laughs> first drink. <laughs> Pretty much the same reaction. <coughs> Whoa. <laughs> well, that's a lot of mint. <coughs> Wow, very minty. Should you guys be by Rivers of America? What is going on here? <laughs> so we have here Donald Duck's cousins right here. And they're just chilling out here at the French market. Here they go. <laughs> We have some other friends here too. These are Cinderella's birds, obviously, looking for a handout. Okay, so the train uh, just made the whistle like it was getting ready to leave the station. Now it's. Oh, it's backing up. That's weird. Normally the signal for when they're leaving is two short whistles, but this one, these were two long whistles. Oh, wait, there it goes. It's moving. It's starting to move, but very, very slowly, though. All right, looks like, uh, looks like we're okay. All right, well, I might as well bite into this. Once again, um, this is non-alcoholic, just to let you guys know, no alcohol. They don't serve alcohol here in Disneyland unless you're going to Club 33. But yeah, I've seen kids drink this too. Hey, hey, what's going on here? Oh, oh, you guys, you guys, what? Hey, what's going on, hmm? I sure hope that's not what I think it is. So I was just looking through my camera here. There's a 
bug on my camera. Get off. Uh, I was just looking through the footage on this particular camera, and I still have my old footage from when I met Christian, Isabel, and Felipe. Uh, <laughs> I just can't... I can't find myself deleting that footage because it's so, you know, interesting but and fun. It was fun, and yeah, so it's hard to delete that footage, but I was just looking through it, so <laughs> good memories. Hey, guys, if you're watching. <laughs> so I haven't really gone over what this contains, but obviously it has potato, it has clam chowder in it, and uh, it had, like, little bits of pepper, it looks like a little bit of celery, um... And obviously a lot of creamy potato. <laughs> mm. So good, I can't stop eating it. <laughs> well, as you can see, I am literally finished with the clam chowder, but I'm still scraping off the little bits off the sides here. But it was actually really, really good. So uh, since I have already gotten two things now here in New Orleans Square, um, you know, when I was here at the French Market, I got the beef stew. At the other restaurant, I got the uh, creamy clam chowder. I would have to say it's a pretty good tie. I mean, they, they were both served in the sourdough bread bowl here. And um, they were both really, really good. And plus, you know, you can't go wrong with this. This was very tasty, too. I, I guess you could say I've missed it, so, uh, yeah. Sequel for this one. <laughs> oh. That mint taste, though. <laughs> Can't ignore that minty taste. Wow. Now, this is something that I forgot to show you guys in my French Market episode, but sometimes here at the French Market, they have a live band playing for you. So, yeah. Here's a little snippet of what's going on. sure you're supposed to finish the bread bowl, but uh, I'm done for right now. I don't know what happened, but my video telling you guys what I thought about the restaurant is gone. It's missing. So, I'm just going to give you guys a quick review of what I thought of the restaurant was. I thought it was really good. It was uh, tasty. The clam chowder was awesome. Try it out for yourselves. Be sure to check out the Royal Street Veranda. It's in New Orleans Square. It's like right next door to Pirates of the Caribbean. And that's pretty much it. Sorry I wasn't able to film actually there at the restaurant because there's only like two or three tables there. So I had to film at the French market. So, oh well. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. See you guys next time here on the Design Video Series. Bye.